So David Siegel, he's out as CEO at Westgate Resorts. Let's talk about it right after this. Hello and welcome to Destination Time here. I'm Jeremy. We're talking about what some people consider the most hated timeshare brand in the entire industry. Is it that? Is it not that? I'm not too sure. We haven't stated one, well, at least not yet. But let me know your thoughts down below. We're going to be talking today about David Siegel, kind of the patriarch of the Westgate Resort brand. Been a timeshare brand for a long time. He's been the owner the entire time. He's been the CEO, chairman of the board. He's been really heavily involved in this. Well, they actually announced in late March that they actually transitioned over to a new CEO, effective March the 5th. This CEO is Jim Gissy, longtime friend, says 40 year friend and associate with David Siegel. Says essentially one of his best friends. He's kind of been mentoring him, I guess, to become the CEO ever since he was a sales rep early, early on within the company. In fact, one of their best sales reps that they've ever had. If you've ever been to one of their presentations, let me know down in the comments what it's like. Is it as bad as people claim it to be? Because I don't know, but maybe we'll find out someday ourselves. But yeah, he joined the company back in 1984. And like I said, immediately began setting sales records within the company and even the industry. And I actually read that back in 1996, Gissy even won an RD award. If you don't know what an RD award is, well, I guess it has to do with ARDA, the American Resort Development Association, which is kind of the industry trade group for the timeshare industry. Well, <laughs> they apparently have awards, just like the Oscars and the Grammys, I guess. But he actually won one of these ARDA awards for being a top sales executive in a number of different accolades in his time within the timeshare industry. Looks like CEO David Siegel is out. And this new guy, well, I guess he's not really new because he's been with the company for 40 years. He's in. Now, it does also say that David Siegel, well, he's still going to be chairman of the board and he's pretty much going to be still in the driver's seat for the overall direction of the company. Obviously, the CEO is kind of there to make sure and manage and maintain the day to day overall operations and kind of drive forward essentially what the board and the chairman have decided the direction of the company should take. So I don't really see too many changes with David Siegel out because a number of years ago, he actually said that he was going to be taking a bit of a step back and kind of taking on some different things outside of essentially the company. So there you are, kind of the new news with Westgate Resorts. It's actually kind of a pretty big announcement because David Siegel is 88 years old. So at some point in time, he's going to have to step down. Or do you think he'll stay there till the very end? I do hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you don't like Westgate Resorts, well, even give this video a thumbs up too. And if you want to see another video about some timeshares in Orlando, Westgate has a big presence there, a lot of resorts, but so does Marriott Vacation Club. So if you're looking to stay in Orlando, check out this video right here, comparing all of the Marriott Vacation Club properties in Orlando, Florida. Thanks for watching. And remember until next time, the best destination, it's always a timeshare.